Alrighty, here's a walkthrough from my Represent app. It's not a true screen capture, but please bear with me. Um, there's the main view for the mobile and the watch. If you click current location to get started, it'll default to the dummy location with Nevada with a list of the senators and representatives there. It's scrollable to account for possibly more representatives in a given zip code. Um, and it will also pop up on the watch main view. You can click latest tweet to view their latest tweet. And just click anywhere outside of it to get out of it. You can click website and that will pull up the web page. You can click more info to get to the detailed view here um, with the current committees and the recently sponsored bills. Um, you can also click on their picture. Um, and so the picture didn't change, but the color scheme and name did. Or you can click on their name to get there. And you can also get to the detailed view from the watch view. So we'll just scroll through these really quick. So picture hasn't changed, but again, name and party and position has. Um, so you just have to click on the watch main view to get to the detailed view. And then you can scroll up to view the 2012 presidential vote results. In this case for the dummy location, Ruth, Nevada. But we can go back and change that location Let's do 94598. So now it's displaying things for the zip code 94598. And it will refresh the it'll refresh the congressional view and the watch main view to account for those changes. And now if we scroll up, we're getting it for the location 94598. Um, and finally, I just wanted to demonstrate the So when I set the acceleration high, this reloads the congressional view with a new location and it's randomly chosen. So let me show you that one more time. So here are the new coordinates that are just being randomly selected uh, and it will update accordingly. Thank you.